Rob, for the second time in three days, West Suburban students and their parents staging a rally for in-person instruction and for fall sports, saying that remote instruction is itself a threat to their health. Social interaction is necessary not only to help students collaborate in learning, but also to keep us mentally stable. Over the past eight months, I know more kids suffering from depression than I do COVID-19. Those students and parents gathering in the rain on the steps of Hinsdale Central High School calling on the district to reinstitute in-person learning. This comes on the heels of a similar demonstration Tuesday night in Wheaton. These students and parents say they are confident that the district can create a safe environment in the school for learning. If the survival rates for someone 18 or younger is 99.9%, .9%, then I ask the question why? Why are we still isolated and sitting behind a screen when other schools are having in-person learning in the next town over? The DuPage County Health Department guidelines say for broader in-person learning to occur, the county's test positivity rate needs to be at or below 5%. It is currently at 5.5%. Now, today, the governor said statewide test positivity rates would need to come down significantly for all fall sports to be allowed and for state guidelines on in-person learning to be eased. And he pushed back on the argument that young people are generally asymptomatic, saying that makes them prone to spreading the virus unknowingly to vulnerable populations. You should take a look. Our hospitalizations in the state are rising, and this is problematic. So um, we're watching very closely, even though we've got our positivity rates moving in the right direction in many regions, uh, that hasn't kept people from going to the hospital. We reached out to officials at Hinsdale Township High School, District 86, for comments on today's uh, gathering here at Hinsdale Central. A spokesperson declined to give a statement. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.